हेलो फ्रेंड्स आई एम डॉक्टर अभिषेक कुलकर्णी कंसल्टेंट एंड हेड डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ पीडियाट्रिक एंड अडोलसेंट एंडोक्रिनोलॉजी एट नारायणा हेल्थ एस आर सी सी चिल्ड्रंस हॉस्पिटल मुंबई टुडे आई एम हियर टू ब्रीफली डिस्कस द वेरियस सब टाइप्स ऑफ डायबिटीज सीन इन चिल्ड्रन एंड अडोलसेंट्स All of us are aware of the increasing incidence of diabetes in the pediatric and adolescent population and also better detection because of awareness and access to diagnostic tools. Amongst the subtypes of diabetes in children and adolescents, type 1 or the condition which develops due to deficiency of insulin secondary to autoimmune inflammation in the body is the commonest these ch- children present with frank symptoms of excess thirst excess urination and weight loss in spite of normal or increased appetite a quick detection in time and management in an appropriate setting either hospital or clinic based is mandatory for these children to prevent development of complications like ketoacidosis and diabetic coma these children require multiple daily dose insulin injections or continuous subcutaneous insulin infusion via technology driven insulin pumps and other hybrid closed loop devices insulin replacement by either of the modalities is a must in children with type 1 diabetes the second most common type of diabetes in children and adolescents is as commonly known as type 2 develops due to insulin resistance predominantly in the setting of the child or adolescent being overweight or obese bad lifestyle and underlying genetic predisposition are the common causes of the condition increasing in the childhood and adolescent population these children can be managed with dietary and lifestyle modifications and oral anti uh, oral hypoglycemic agents except in certain situations like at detection while the evaluation is being done and during sick days where your healthcare provider may suggest insulin replacement even in type 2 diabetes but essentially for a long time in patients with good beta cell reserve type 2 diabetes can be managed without insulin a quick word on rarer forms of diabetes though the percentage of all of this is less than 2% in children and adolescents parents and healthcare providers must be aware of rarer causes like genetic where diabetes could run in families drug induced or disease related secondary diabetes these are best detected and treated under the supervision of specialized units in the modern era access to the best standard of care for children and adolescents with diabetes is an essential right across subtypes and in the current era all children affected with diabetes can be managed well can be made to lead a near normal life and a good quality of life and productivity can be provided to them with an expectation of them leading a near normal life